Previously on Going Mainstream. The place is somewhat dangerous and she may not be exactly compliant. We have a girl, Sunny, you know, uh, Mal. There's a certain flop house in the East District of the Combat Zone. How are we going to survive the Combat Zone? Take her back to Bite Radio and let me know when the professor has made contact with her. It'll be a lot harder to get this done during a night, but if we go a day, they might not be expecting that, if anyone is expecting I'm us. not going in there without some help. I've got some friends. See, you guys are into some trouble. I could use a bit of backup if there is one or two you could spare. Spare you a one chroma, I'm sure. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that was fucking wild! Anyone use Combat Cab before? I don't like to because I don't like to go into the combat zone, but uh, I have once. There's a time for everything, I suppose. You might not stay in the combat zone breathing for much longer. We're, we're all going to go together. Yes. We're going to help her recover from her clear addictions to things that aren't, and maybe she's in with some bad people. I don't fucking know. So you're going to help someone clear up their addiction? Yeah. <laughs> Now, okay, I I order us a, a combat cab. A combat cab. <laughs> so enough to fit. Um, there is. Yeah, yeah, it's a maxi people. combat cab. Five yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it's like a minivan uh, with spiked metal plates uh, hammered onto the sides. The guy who drives it, uh, he wears a sailor cap. Calls himself the captain. Beautiful. <laughs> of his little ship. He's got, uh, uh, the front dash has got, like, a stack of four different, like, CB radios (laughs) with various, like, different handheld things he uses to talk to other combat cabs. Yeah. He's constantly getting reports from them about firefights and stuff in the combat zone. He himself is a happy-go-lucky, wild and free guy who, who, who doesn't seem to care that he drives into a literal war zone every night. I look at Bob. What's up? Bob, you want to get in front? Yeah. Oh, Captain, my Captain, is the seat so. taken? Thought so. All aboard! Woo-hoo! Choo-choo! <laughs> Chugga-chugga, big red boat. <laughs> and he... Something like that. Ah, I like your style. You're going to like this guy. Wait a minute. Yeah. You do the morning I show. Do the morning show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I tell you, I tell you. There is some messed up fucking shit in this city. They just they. I start get into talking. the back. I yeah. get. They into, start yeah. talking. They talk about all the conspiracies, yep. and they are just getting on. The like, best way to hit a person like while you're driving a car so that their body doesn't damage the car, <laughs> it's at an angle, forty five degrees. <laughs> so they bounce off. They're deflected. Uh. They flicked off the car. Lovely. Rather than in the middle. Is that what you talk about? The, yeah. 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 I mean, yeah. he gives you these pointers. Speaking himself. of the He's, middle, I'm really excited to learn. <laughs> yeah. It's a combat cab. Uh, it costs a pretty penny. It costs quite a lot more than a normal cab does. But hey, junk's on finance from his higher up. So Apparently, lucky so you guys. I hand, <laughs> I hand over the card. I motion for Bob to give him, give him the address. Address given. He does an awesome burnout for no reason. It doesn't need to. Uh, <laughs> other than we're just going, fuck yeah. Yeah. He, he's performing a little bit for Bob. He's a bit of a fan. Uh, he peels out doing a nice little donut before his van, his surprisingly powerful <laughs> van, tears off towards the combat zone. Cass uh, is kind of chuckling wryly as Annie's like pumping her woo! fist and like trying to shake the back of the seat that Cass is sitting in. You punks, you're out for yeah. a while. Peeling off into the combat zone. I assume the chrome is fucking loving this. Oh. Bones. 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 Bones is fuck yeah. He's fucking stoked. All, all the fucking combat monsters are like sticking their fists out the window and <laughs> pumping it. <laughs> loving it. I want to see it. Annie and, and Bones do like a big chest bump. <laughs> <laughs> like Annie's a much smaller woman. Like she gets, she gets like just <laughs> dropped. But she gets back up and is like, yeah. 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 Does like the egg guitar. <laughs> Yeah. Is Cassie like studiously like trying to come up with songs, or is she like just past caring while we're That's driving? That's tomorrow's in. problem. Okay. <laughs> yeah, she's like, "Fuck it, I'm done." I think Junk's gonna act like he's not enjoying it, but he can't help have a smirk on his face. It's <laughs> it's fucking great. Yeah. <laughs> Do 
fat drops of sickly rain start to fall as mm. uh, you screech to a halt outside a U shape of ruined apartment buildings. So there's yeah. three apartment buildings. Yeah. A okay. north, uh, a northern one, an eastern one, and a western one. Right. You know which block it's in, and you have an apartment number as well. But there are there are three in that little kind of classic U shape around a parking lot mm-hmm. um, underneath. You could kind of picture it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I lean over forward to the captain and say, "You're waiting here until we return." Sure thing, Jumba. You're on the meter. You're out the front of the parking lot that fronts the uh, three buildings. Uh, the northernmost building is completely burned out. Um, streaks of black soot climbing from the hollow sockets of the empty windows. Uh, and part of that building has entirely collapsed. Um, the parking lot that you're standing in uh, is strewn with burned out cars. Uh, there's a, puddles of hopeless street scum playing dice or having fist fights piles of refuse in just like drifts that you have to uh, walk around to get towards the building nearly every flat surface in sight is crammed with graffiti and diagonally across from the old buildings behind you is an old motel that seems to be a chosen hangout of some nasty looking boosters who are on the uh, top deck of the two-floor motel Mm -hmm calling out to people as they go past and uh, watching like a street boxing bout that's happening in the car park yeah. of the motel. And near them, some chromed up chicks are just kicking the shit out of some guy who's rolling on the floor. Uh, he looks like he was dead a couple of minutes ago, but they're still laying into him and laughing because it's good fun. The building that, uh, sorry, the room that we're supposed to go to, is that in east or west? It's on the east uh, and it's a fifth floor apartment. Right, cool. Room number? 522. All right, let's fucking rock this thing. Uh, I say we go up there, kick out a door, and we fucking just take her out. Like, and put no, her in not, the... not take her out. Put not her in, take put her, her out. So, uh, listen, Bones, uh, what was it, Annie? Yeah, dude, what's uh, up? Okay, so... <laughs> I'm ready, let's do this! Listen, listen, there's this girl in there called Sunny Katama. Or malice. Sunny Katama. Right. Or our job is to get her and get her out, basically. Can I retcon that you have a photo of her, please? <laughs> oh, okay. So yeah. we do have a photo you of her. You have a photo of her. Great. Yeah. She's a, a, a black girl with a mohawk. Right. With a short, like a short dyed pink note mohawk. Where is our van, where is our cab waiting in, in relation to things? Are they just uh, in the, the car park? It's in the center. Like, cool. Just awesome. You can't just- really get into the car park. Because it's yep. fucking covered in crap and people, but yeah, it's it's out the front, pretty much equidistant between the three Brilliant. buildings. Yeah. Uh, uh, so you give the picture. I just I'll the flick the around. picture around. Yeah. Right. Uh, or we did that back at the sure. bite. Um, but you just, makes more sense. just remind everyone. Yeah. This John's is who still we're looking pretty for. pissed off from the altercation earlier, so I'm like, I tend to agree with you. Mm. All right, let's, let's in. fucking just. Uh, 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 did you want to say something, or was it? <laughs> Is well, it Annie, does Annie want to say something? <laughs> or is it Cassie? Annie, I think I'd defer to your expertise. I think Bone Daddy over here should head up front since he's the biggest and gnarliest, and I'll head up the back, and then you guys stay in the middle. All right, Bones, sound how good? does that sound? Do you want to fucking <laughs> <laughs> sound good to me? <laughs> fucking yeah! All right, I'll, I'll jump in behind Bone, so I'll be second in line. Sure. Do you, do you want Phil a, a, a do you marching, need a marching order? order? Or are you happy just uh, for us to rock it? That's fine. Don't, right. don't cool. worry about it. <laughs> right, I think cool. Castle... D&D campaign. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. no, no, no. no. We tie a rope around each other's waist. Like, think more visually, right? Yeah. Think of the five of you, like, think... turning people's heads, turn... As we fucking you... step out of a As you step battle out of a van, fucking combat van, yeah. cab. Yeah. All of you, like... Putting guns, guns in our hands. Yeah. In the... And sh- you know, the guys, that, uh, the people who are pros start checking, mm-hmm. Check it out. cocking yep. their guns. There's a fucking whistle... Uh, from the motel is like a couple of the chromas like start pointing at you and be like oh yeah okay what the fuck's going on here okay heads turn you have a couple of the street scum see you cross the parking lot uh, and then uh, slightly in slow motion when, uh, yeah. you're sil- silhouetted by by the, <laughs> the light smog. by the <laughs> light from outside well, as you and enter the, rain, the darkened lobby the rain uh, and the rain starts to get heavier as you as you enter the building 
Now, as you enter the building, the smell's pretty overpowering. There are animal-like howls you can hear from coming from above you, a bit of sickening laughter, a rat-a-tat-tat of gunfire from the distance, not from within the building, yeah. completes the soundscape. It's like the thrashing of like a dying animal. In the lobby, leaning outside the ruined lifts at the bottom of the stairwell, you would notice, Bob, you mm. would recognise a Fagin from the Twists. Ah. Oh. Easily recognised by his... <laughs> go, no, go for it. Laugh. It's his invention. <laughs> a Fagin. A Fagin. He's a Fagin. Oh, That's what they're called. This... Holy shit. Is you made an singing? Oliver Twist game. You made an Oliver Twist game. Singing yeah. a tune. Fan fucking He's whistling. Is he whistling? <laughs> Uncle, He's Uncle Bob is from a gang called The Twists, which is an Oliver Twist poser gang. But you're from the gang? Yeah. Yes. Jesus Christ. Fuck me. <laughs> all the, uh, that they, is amazing. Are, all the hens are coming home to roost. Yeah. So all the uh, I said, give me ideas and I will incorporate them. Yep. Here they are. There we uh, go. The gang is, uh, for the listeners, the gang is the idea of always pushing themselves uh, so they can have, uh, can I have some more? Can Effectively some more. is like the, the catch cry of the gang. I have twisted the gang a little bit further. Them. Oh, rad. Fagans run gangs of kids. Yes. Of 8 to 12-year-old kids. Ooh, yeah, rock on. Sweet. So a Fagan runs a squad of little Olivers, essentially. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. Just, and they're always out to get more. Yep. Yeah. Like coming towards you would be just... It's terrifying. Terrifying. Yeah. People are still scared of, of, of you know, harming kids because... It's a blight on your conscience. Uh, so, yes, you immediately recognise this as, as a Fagin from the twists. Yeah. The others might be less familiar, uh, depending on how good they are with their streetwise. Street He's easily recognisable to you, Bob, at least, by mm-hmm. his fingerless gloves, ratty coat and flat cap. He's flanked by a couple of prepubescents with wicked grins and lethal-looking flick knives. He looks at Annie and says... Nice coat, Chumbata. Can I have it? Hey, Oliver's. <laughs> <laughs> the little kids look up. What do you want, hey, mister? Listen, put him away. I know what you are. I'm not against it. I'll put you six feet deep. All right, put him kids. Away. All right, kids. These fucking edge runners don't want to have any fun today. I'll, I'll make a move to intimidate the Fagan. Sure. Uh, intimidation is cool. Cool, yeah. It's your will, your willpower versus. So that's says. eighteen. Look, there's five of you. You've all got fucking guns, and he's a guy with two kids. two kids with knives. And I've pretty much said I'm happy to kill kids. Yes, the usual tactics don't work. He he's like, okay, man, just just looking for a bit of fun, yeah. man, just having a laugh, man, just having a Walk. little joke. <laughs> I want to keep my coat, dude. Fine, fine, fine. But you got a few, Walk. few creds, Walk. maybe. Uh, come on, kids. Come on, meat sticks. You ain't got any meat sticks on you. <laughs> Can I not for the chrome to keep walking? walk off. Large amounts of gold. <laughs> <laughs> Singing a little tune. <laughs> you hear people going shit, shit. <laughs> they hear that song. Yeah. Bones, let's keep going. So as you climb the stairs to the fifth floor. You'll have to step over vagrants on the landings uh, and deal with the o- overwhelming smell of piss. You reach her floor and the booming sound of chromatic metal fills the hallway. Uh, a couple of brawling punks fall out into the um, the corridor. They're wrestling. One of them gets the upper hand and starts pummeling the other in the face. He gets a knee to the crotch. And the tables turn. Who's got, this nothing, to do. Who's, got nothing to do with us? Who's winning? Uh, it's about a wash at oh, this stage, okay, yeah. Okay, is there room to move around them? Not for five of you. I mean, one of you might get bashed. They're completely, uh, like, ignoring you We're at this stage. in... So, the, just to be clear, the building is internal. There's not. It's not like a lip outside. It's, no, 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 no. This is one of those, uh, just... It's a straight it's corridor. It's a straight corridor, right. With apartments. Yeah, sweet, sweet, sweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's basic an apartment building, so as you can imagine. Yeah, right. yeah. Uh, the corridor's pretty small, <laughs> and they're just... Fucking going at it. <laughs> There's a wet thunk of, of fists hitting flesh as they try and get the upper hand. Cool. Uh, I'm just going to see who, like, I might be like, hey, hey, Bones, Bones. Yeah, man. I think I'll point to one of them. I think that guy's winning. Let's help him. Sure thing, man. 
Bones just uh, uh, walks down the corridor, taps one of the guys on the shoulder, and as he turns around, he just clocks a pistol whip to the head. Great. The other guy is like, hey, man, what the fuck are you doing? That's my buddy. What the fuck? You just, just caved take, in his just, skull, man. Just, I'll fuck you up. I'll fuck you up, man. Is he still alive? Or is he out? He's, he's out. He's, he's out. on he's the pistol floor. Whip head. He's pistol whipped on the head. He's probably not feeling great right, right mm. now. Eh, crime will fix that. The guy threatens to kill... Bones? Uh, Bones? Can I pop forward and pistol whip him as well? The uh, second guy. Roll initiative. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> You're not doing anything, Cassie? I think she's standing back. <laughs> you <playing> <laughs> 11. This is Bob's idea. Yeah. Uh, I'm on 12, mate. Told you, I'm not rolling great. Uh, he's first. Yeah, great. Um, and can you roll your reflex 8 for... Bonesy. Bones. 16. Uh, so he's first. Uh, so who was last? You were. That would be me. Yeah, what are you going to do? Crack him in the head with a with my pistol. Then it was... Uh, that's yeah. Bob. So Bob is going to like charge forward and crash tackle him. Actually, no. He'll point, point the gun and be like, shut the fuck up. Yep, we'll fucking cap you. Uh, this guy is going to knife Bones, and Bones is just going to grab him by the shoulders and headbutt the fucker. <laughs> He's first. Oh, the guy rolls very poorly. Uh, so, as the punk screams, I fucking cut you, man! You put fucking fucked up my friend! He goes for a knife, and as he goes to, to, to reach, he gets clocks a headbutt right. Cool. To the face. Right in the nose. Yeah. That's a good spot. Bridge of the nose. Bridge in the nose. He stumbles back. Yep. Um, but he is not out yet. Not quite. Mm. So he goes next. Yep. And he charges forward uh, with his knife. The punk stumbles back from his headbutt, crouching low, wipes blood from his nose, reverses his grip on his knife, hmm. and does a low lunge Burying the knife into Bones' leg. Into his bone. Don't Hopefully say that. Not. <laughs> That'd be a little deep. It's five damage. Okay. Uh, he's a pretty big guy, so I'm going to take uh, two off that for his body type. It, it basically goes through armor because it's a bladed weapon. Mm. So, uh, three damage. Uh, not horrendous, but uh, not pleasant. Yeah. At all. Gotta, gotta piss him off. Yeah, so he buries the knife into his thigh, essentially. Mm-hmm. Um, for for three damage. Uh, oh, he goes down. Oh, oh no! Boy. Uh, Damn. He bone screams in pain as it digs into his muscle, and he uh, uh, momentarily s- slumps against the side of the corridor with his hands clamped around where the um, blade dug into his thigh. I thought Bones would have this. Who's next? So my action. That was you. Uh, and it's to intimidate. With okay, I do it. Intimidate yeah. him. So that is a 24. Okay, sure. Uh, his composure, he fumbles it. So he's like, fuck no, man, don't fucking shoot. We're just, we're just fucking sorting things out, man. It's just a fucking knife, okay, man. Just no, no, no guns Cassie needed. Kinda. Fucking hell, man. Sean, your action. Well, I was gonna, still going to, I was going to clock him in the head. Where are we at with that? If he's yeah, you now can, you saying. Can, uh, well, the situation has changed. Yeah. You don't necessarily have to clock him in, t- in the head. Uh, you still could if you want to. <laughs> What's he holding? Uh, a switchblade. Give me a knife. Okay, man. Okay. Okay. Drops it. Fucking hell, man. Me me and my buddy are just trying to fucking hey, sort something hey, out you, over a you, girl, you, man. You, you fucking get, take your friend back in. Shut the door. He grabs the guy's jacket by the the shoulders. Yeah. Um, his uh, rip sleeve denim jacket. And the guy gives a, a wet gurgly cough as he drags him into the room. <coughs> he sounds fine to me. Hey, before you go, have you seen this girl? Malice? Yeah, yeah, she uh, lives at the end of the hall, man. They're all fucking glass heads in there. Cool. His bones. Thank you for your service. <laughs> Fuck you. Throw you back, man. Bye. Oh, oh man, bones. You are... I mean, I'm, I'm... Speak to me, man. <laughs> tell him about, me me about your show. Oh, hey, don't forget to listen to Wake Up I Night City. I don't think now is Fuck the you, time. man! Fuck off! It's in the morning! Does Bones need help I up or is he... I don't think now is the time, Bob. How's Bones Every doing? Every time is an opportunity to advertise. Jesus. Bones... Bones still hasn't got up. He's... <laughs> oh, no. He's bleeding quite badly. Bones is... Is there a way to... Can we save him? 
Yeah, I yeah, mean, he's, he's fine. Not dead. Oh, he's fine. No, like, he's, he's just in shock. He's just in shock because the guy, like, got him real good in the thigh. Bones, bones. Is this the first time you've ever been stabbed? God fucking hell, man. Is this fuck, the first time you've fuck, ever fuck, actually fuck, been. Fuck, a- not. N- this no, is, this is a, no, no, no. <laughs> Bones, this is the first time you've ever been stabbed, isn't fucking it? Fucking maybe. It fucking hurts like shit. Oh man. my god. Cassie, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold him up. I'm gonna like support him, and we're just gonna have to keep going. <laughs> He, he, and he gets figure, on the other side. He'll figure it out. He'll figure it out. He'll figure he's it out. actually not hurt. He's just constantly being like, oh, I'm in so much pain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he just, he's not used to it. <laughs> and he gets on the other side, so junk, one side, bones, and then... Okay, and he, the two and of then you are fucking yeah. lifting him yeah. up. And then he can hobble. He then can she's hobble, kind yeah. of whispering, hey, man, that's pretty as fucking metal. You can bleed in and shit. That's really cool, dude. <laughs> can I have something to, like, like plug it up or something? Has anyone got... What's in your What's in your What's in your fanny pack? Uh, hold on, and uh, oh Bob will open up his fanny pack, and like, I think he's found like I don't know what would he find in there. What the fuck you is got in some there? fucking rags? Anyone? Did anyone like tear, tear a sleeve off, of off their shit. clothes? I'm not tearing this. I am this not is tearing. Style. Fucking hell, man! I'm bleeding clothes. everywhere. Will someone fucking help me, please? I'm gonna rip part of his shirt. Yeah. Yeah, you pull. <laughs> yeah, that settles that. You pull the arm off his shirt. You form it into a bandage. He stops bleeding. He's, okay, man. I think good? I can. I think I can walk. You can it's walk. It's really good. the most diplomatic oh, way of doing this. Uh, <laughs> this is a good work, Bones. You head burn that guy real good. Just watch out for your feet next time. <laughs> Maybe you think a little faster on your feet. Ready you, reach, up. you reach the end of the corridor, uh, and five twenty two has uh, the door hanging limply from its hinges. Uh, inside is a scene of destitution and decay. There's maybe a dozen people in this squalid apartment. Most of them are staring at the walls. Blue tarps hanging give the suggestion of privacy between various parts of the house, but people are lounged on dirty mattresses or... Piles of cardboard or rags. None of them are paying attention to us. They're all lost in their own world, pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah. Okay. Uh, one person dances through the apartment to music you can't hear. Rad. Is it immediately uh, obvious where um, Malice is? Not from the door. All right. I think the room is pretty full without the five of us walking in. Who wants to go in and find her? I'll head through. All right, Junk. You got a gun? I have two. All right. Uh, well, that's better than one. And a knife. <laughs> hey. I think maybe I should come with you, Junk. Not that you can't be persuasive, but some things just need a feminine touch, you know? Fair enough. All right, I'll leave you to do it. I'm going to stay out here and watch for fucking twists. Annie, I don't... It's just like, I'm not letting you go in, go in there... By yourself? Yeah, she's your bodyguard. Who's this guy? She's your bodyguard, so come she's going to come, come with, with you. you. So there's three of you going in. Yeah. Yeah. Bones? Okay. Bones. Bones, do you want to stay out or no, you want to go in? Okay. Bones, Fuck stay. Hell, I'll watch. I'll watch the door, man. Bones, stay. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> guy's such a liability. I love him. <laughs> we love him. <laughs> you saved my goddamn life. <laughs> Creeping through the apartment, you quickly spy Malice in a back room. Yeah, she's there. What seems to maybe be her boyfriend, and he is in the middle of handing her uh, like a scratched up air hypo that has obviously been uh, like reloaded after its recommended initial use several times. Uh, it, it's your cyberpunk equivalent of a used needle. Mm-hmm. You're guessing it's got blue glass in it, uh, and she's just about to stick herself with it. What do you do? Can he see us come in? He does see you come in. She doesn't. She's focused on the hypo. He hands it over to her. Uh, you've got about five, four. You want to drop three, it? I'm going to aim my gun at him. Two. She's holding it, not him. Oh, she's holding it. She's just like he hands it to her as you open the door. Well, I want to run through and grab it from her. Fast hands. Roll your fast hands. Good use of that skill. Please fumble. Uh, no, I got a critical success. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so I roll again. Jesus. <laughs> Uh, so I was waiting for the fumble. Fumble, you, you, just, you just you grab it and, and get hit with the blue glass. That twenty six, fantastic. Um, so uh, on a, on a, a, a wonderful success like twenty six, you get to give us a bit of flair, and you tell us uh, what you do when you see her about to yep. hit herself with the blue glass. So I walk into the room. I see uh, the boyfriend who's noticed me but has already handed off the mm-hmm. the needle to her. Um, straight away, I pull the gun into my right hand. 
I roll forward with my left. I grab the oh, needle. You like a combat roll? Yep. Sick, man. <laughs> <laughs> when I come back up, I'm sitting side by side uh, with her. I grab the needle, chuck it away to the corner of the room with my right hand. I'm aiming it straight at the boyfriend. I look straight up at Cassie. And um, so I said, get her, take her out. Cassie runs over. Hey, Malice, sweetie. Hey, who the fuck hey, Malice, am, man? I'm a friend. Where's my- I'm a friend of Amelie's. Gone, man. We're going Can to. Can you a... give me my hypo, man? I was just about to. We've to got fly, something way man. better waiting in the car. No, trust no, me. no! I just want to get high right the fuck now, man. We've got stuff for you, Amelie. Oh, Come with this is some fat. Malice, Sunny. Can I give her a slap? Sure. Why not? <laughs> Wake her up. You slap her across the face. Sunny. Jesus, fuck, man. What? Hey. Come with me, all right? I'm a friend of Amelie's. Who the fuck are you guys, man? I am Cassie Glass, and I'm here to get you out. We're going to make some music together. But I fucking live here, man. Get me out where? We're going straight to Pathogen Records, and you're going to record your new album. Sound good? Uh... I don't know. I don't well, too make... bad, sweetheart. She can yank her up <laughs> off the fucking bed. Nice. <laughs> you're this given is... the option. Now you're now being told. She's, she's a fucking tweaker. She's yeah. no fucking clue what's going on. This is right. the music industry, bitch. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> the other guy is just like, he he's not doing anything. He doesn't speak. Like, he's, you've got a gun in his face. He's just like, yeah, cool. Who the fuck are these guys? Am I hallucinating? Will I die? <laughs> Will yeah. I die? He literally says nothing. I'm going to okay. keep the gun aimed at him as so... we're walking out with. I'm As assuming we're he out. starts crawling towards the hypo, looking Can to see I if you react. Can I go and stomp it before I? No, 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 because I might stab myself. So let's just leave it. <laughs> let's just leave that. He can do whatever the fuck he wants. And when he notices that you're not reacting, he just skitters over to. Yeah, it cool. And, just... and within, by the time you back out the door, he's flashing out, just oh. pretty lights and colours. Can't see shit. You know, you so, could have just let her stab herself and then just carry her limp body out. We don't want her high. You could have. <laughs> Do, we don't. We're trying to save l- Does Bob say that? We're trying to no, save I lives I here, people. No. <laughs> I don't know what it was. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, context. The, the people passed out on the floor. <laughs> yeah. It's heroin den, I think. Well, it would be awful to go in, be ready to, like, get watch, her out of yeah, there. Yeah, watch her OD. Just watch her yeah. OD. Just walk casually. Well, you said back. it was, like, it was been reused about three times past At its... At least. She could have died. And then yeah. come back to That's Amelie true. and be like, mm, sorry. We <laughs> saw her die. Yeah. We've heard her last words. We literally words. did nothing. I thought about doing a combat <laughs> role. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Going Mainstream is a Baby Beard Media production. Find us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and all our podcasts are on Spreaker, YouTube and all good podcatchers. Cyberpunk 2020 and all associated properties are trademark for our Telsorian games. Used with permission.